U.S. President Joe Biden's West Asia trip is over. Saudi Arabia did not give any assurances about increasing oil production. One development was the beginning of the normalization of ties between Saudi Arabia and Israel. Biden announced that Israel had given its go-ahead for the transfer of the islands of Tehran and Sanafir from Egypt to Saudi Arabia. Now, the two islands are located at the entrance to the Gulf of Aqba in the Red Sea. Now, what makes these islands so strategic is their location. Israel has one port that connects to the Red Sea. The sea passage for Israel can be blocked by anyone controlling Tehran Island. Now, this is exactly what Egypt did in the 1967 war between the two nations. Israel then occupied the islands. Both sides signed the Camp David Peace Accords in 1982, and control of the islands was handed back to Egypt. The peace accords stated that Israel had a say in what happens to the islands. Now that Israel has agreed to the transfer, Saudi Arabia will be able to take over control of the islands from Egypt. Riyadh has assured Israel that there will be no threat to its shipping in the Red Sea. Biden announced this in a press conference in Jeddah. We concluded a historic deal that uh, to transform a flashpoint at the heart of the Middle East wars into an area of peace. International peacekeepers, including U.S. troops, will leave Tehran Island in the Red Sea, where they've been for over 40 years since the Camp David Accords. Five American soldiers died on this strategically located island in 2020, and it's important to remember them today. Now, thanks to the break, this breakthrough, this island will be open to tourism and economic development while uh, retaining all necessary security arrangements and, uh, and uh, the present freedom of navigation of all parties, including Israel. Saudi Arabia had claims to the islands dating back to about a century. Egypt had initially agreed to hand them over in 2017, but faced both domestic challenges and resistance from Israel. Now Saudi Arabia can finally conclude the island transfer. Riyadh says it plans to develop the islands as tourist destinations. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.